Good morning, welcome back to a new video. It's a very snowy, snowy weather and snow is falling. And that means if snow is piling up, we need a solution to get rid of it. It's not a lot now, but it might get, so we are just gonna get prepared. In this video, we actually wanna plow some snow out, just put on the mower a plow and just try it out. It's not like it's big enough layer where you need it, I could easily drive out or walk, but I just wanna try it out and have it set up in case it does snow, because if it keeps continuing snowing like this, it can pile up really quick and it hasn't stopped since the morning, uh, really early morning and it's been snowing and snowing and snowing and piling up. So yeah, you never know what's gonna happen. So we're gonna set it up. But before we do that, we have to put on the plow. Well, first of all, we have to take off the pan of the mower and put on the pan. We're actually gonna use our second mower, which we didn't use for cutting. We used this one, but this one has a flat tire and I've been waiting one month for a spare ones to arrive and some other parts. So yeah, that's still a thing. And it was like a nice shop, like really expensive and they have a local store with tractors actually selling tractors. And this is how long they're taking to send a one tiny part, you know. So yeah, um, but uh, till we do that, we're gonna have put it on to the other mower, mower and gonna use that. So let's get started. Nice, no? Actually, it's not that rotten, but needs work. We'll fix it. It in, it's in choke accidentally where you started from. I think I closed the choke, that's why <laughs> I've done it. I did it, I do it every time, but ours doesn't pop so much, it just does a bit of a poop. That? This was just like a gunfire. <laughs> yeah, I felt it in my heart and my ears. <laughs> I am amazed. Now they're a lot more deeper in as well. I'm extremely surprised how well that works. It was slipping and sliding, but that's just some chains we'll fix. Um, but the chains are like 60 euros. I'll see what I can get. 
pro probably I do need chains. I don't think I can get like tractor style wheels. And this is probably something we're gonna sell anyway, so we're not gonna keep it. So no point of upgrading in this. I'm just gonna fix it all up so it works. But uh, the snow shovel, amazing tools. Hoops of snow, really fun. And it's much more fun than big shovel and the tractor. That one's just stressful, you're gonna knock something down. This one, you knock something that you're not supposed to and just gonna slide in circles. It cannot do much damage. And it doesn't damage the ground at all because it has this rubber flap. It works so good. It's just scooping the snow and not minding the ground at all. So really amazed of this. So yeah, there's one more thing we wanna show you, which was to do with yesterday's deals. We got again, as we said in the previous video, we said we got rock wool, we got bricks there, we got lots of things on discount, we got something else, we got a chainsaw. So yeah, we are ready for going wood harvesting, which we're gonna do this winter, actually starting up next week. We're gonna go to my uncle's place, my aunt's and uncle's place, and we're gonna be starting cutting wood. And uh, my uncle only has a small chainsaw, a petrol one, and he has electric but battery powered, but still, uh, but I bought this one. This is like a Czech Republic made, pretty good brand, so I think it's gonna last us pretty good, and it has quite a lot of power. So it should be able to take down pretty big trees, 40 centimeters or whatever was the inches, so yeah. Hopefully that's big enough, but yeah, it's gonna be quite exercise. It is heavy to work with, but uh, I think I'm gonna get used to it after a few hours of working in the, not forest, but the ditch. So yeah, uh, let's get to try to use this because we have two trees we wanna get rid of because they are way too close to each other planted and they get really big. So let's go see which trees those are. So we're gonna cut all these trees down and no, I'm just kidding. That was just a joke. Let's go through Yeah, those are beautiful. We're not cutting those down. Even though they're also grown like planted next to each other way too much, but it's okay. We like these ones. So these are the trees we're gonna cut. Not all of them. We're just gonna split them up. They're planted way too close to each other. These are linden trees. So if you know linden trees, they get really tall, really huge. We have one at our entrance. It's huge, very tall, maybe 30, 40 meters. I don't really know. I can't say a tree size from that. But yeah, these get huge and these middle ones are really struggling because the side ones get more light and uh, yeah, we don't need them like this. So we're gonna cut the two middle ones out. So also it's easier in summer to c cut the grass underneath and take care of it. And But yeah, the middle ones definitely need to go. Not a good idea. So let's get started with the new chainsaw. <laughs> like what we are doing. Oh, should we put it back? There's not going back. Look at the space we have now. We can actually cut grass here. But I liked it. They're gonna get as big as this one. So I guess we. it, it is better to cut them and make them puffier. I mean, you cannot really tell anything. I love something so sad about trees. We cut it and give more space to the other trees. I'm sad, okay? Oh, beautiful day it is. saw is absolutely amazing that's really good it's all thanks to a good chain of course and uh, yeah the saw is really powerful no problem at all I don't need to put any extra pressure it just goes through the wood like butter not the hardest tree either to cut but 
pretty good. I like it. How it cuts and how fast I went through it. Just zig, 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 zig. The one we have with the electricity is really bad. Could be the chain. Maybe if you got a new chain, maybe it would be good. But also lack of power on it. So now we have more, one more to cut. So let's move over to that before it's too dark. Oh, I'm not looking forward to going to my uncle. I'm not looking forward to it that much. I love it. I like doing it. But it's a very, very heavy work. As you can see, it's very dark. Sun is set long time ago already. It's snowing quite nicely and we are done. We cut two trees down. It might look sad that we're cutting trees down, but those ones definitely need cutting. And uh, now the three trees can actually grow and be nicer. We have to still trim the bottoms there and make them nice. Linden trees, something that regrows very good. We're probably gonna be fighting with new ones coming out of those stumps. I don't know if Linden does that, but might do that. Uh, but these ones can actually now spread and get like nice and fluffy like our big one and grow nice and tall. Because they were fighting each other so much, they were growing the branch since like really not the best way for us, getting in our way. So yeah, now hopefully they're going to be doing much better. But yeah, hope you enjoyed this video and we're going to see you next time. Bye bye. Yeah, we are going to cut a lot more wood, but not here.